We're hearing from family members of a truck driver who was killed in a fiery crash in the Keys. Local attention Janine Sandwood is in the newsroom with this developing story. Janine. The family of Charles Shipley Jr. tells us he was heading to Key West with a delivery of food. He never made it, and now they're sharing their memories and their concerns. He was just a loving husband, loving father. Charles Shipley loved his Jeep, dressing up like Elvis. Come on, princess. Come on. And he loved his family. He was always there when I needed him. He was probably the happiest I've seen him in a long time. Me and him had plans that he was going to retire in a couple years. But on December 5th, the experienced big rig driver from Margate was heading southbound on the overseas highway in the Florida Keys. Are you okay? The truck slamming into a concrete barricade at a construction zone and exploding. Shipley died on scene. He held me tight twice for some reason. His mother tells us he had just dropped her off at the airport. She was visiting for the holidays. And then before heading out on his delivery to Key West, he sent her a text. Glad you made it home. I love you. And um, I miss you. I wish I had a premonition of what was going to happen because I would have told him not to go on that run. The Monroe County Sheriff and residents tell us they've been raising concerns that the construction zone, its lane shift to the left and lack of lighting is unsafe. Florida Highway Patrol is investigating. I see a lot of different accidents, but something is of that sort I, I've never seen in my life. 38 years of marriage with my husband is just, it's, it's just painful, very, very painful. The Monroe County Sheriff says he is hopeful that more lighting and reduced speed will be implemented at that construction zone. The family says they're now speaking to an attorney. Uh, We're in the newsroom. I'm Janine Stanwood, Local 10 News.